All right, this is Mr. Henshaw. I'm in my video production class today with the new selfie stick. And I really like it. Follow me on Twitter. Look at that. Look at that. There's my two aides over there. Hey, Hannah, how you doing? Corey? How you guys doing? All right. Wait, let's see who's back there. Let's see if there's any student back here. There should be one person. Let's see if she's back here. Oh, hey, it's Yvette. Hey, Yvette. Okay. Let's see if students are doing their work. All right. All right. They should be working on their interview projects. Doing either questions or editing their questions. Let's see. Let's see who's working on their projects. Let's see here. All right. Hey, there's some guys working right there. Look at that. They're editing a video for Mr. Cox right here. We're going to do a little commercial for Mr. Cox. Look at that. Hey, uh. Hey Brandon. Hello. Say hi. Hi there. Look over here. Uh, no, I have, I have okay. They're focused on editing. Good job, guys. <laughs> so they're doing the, the uh, auto shop right now. A little commercial. All right. These guys right here are at the teacher interviews right here. Look at that. All right. All right. You gotta love this new selfie stick. What's going on over here? What are you guys doing over here? They're not ready over here. Suddenly they're not ready. Come on now. You guys should be editing your project. No pressure. Oh my gosh. Oh. There's some students working right there. Look at that. They're editing. I like that. So this week um, my students are working on interviews and interviewing uh, teachers or mentors or people that are important in their lives and I'm teaching them how to do that and then shoot b-roll to put with the interviews um, and then also I'm having some students do special projects who are a little more advanced. Um, hey this is Mr. Henshaw, I'm over here at uh, Curry Printing and I'm talking with Kevin Howard, the proprietor of this establishment. And Kevin's a good friend of mine, been in printing for several years. In fact, I've known him for over 20 years. We met in Tulare back in the day. And uh, this is his print shop, at least the front office. There's, there's Kevin with a customer back there. And Kevin has asked me to come down here and, and make a little commercial for him. So I told him I'd help him with that. So that's what we're gonna do today, is make a little commercial for Kevin. But I wanted to give you a little tour of the print shop. Yeah, look at that bad boy. Nice three-hole punch there. So it's called comb binding or GBC binding. So Kevin's gonna put these in the machine here to set it all up to bind. And then over here, puts in the paper to punch it. And it, it perforates these like uh, rectangles and the rectangles that go inside here. And Kevin puts them all in there, lines them all up, flips them over and then it closes it all up and then you have a nice little binded book. So if you wanna do a report some type of project. It's a good way to bind up to what? About an inch? Two inches? Two inches. Yeah. Set it for paper setting, tray four. You can see CMYK colors. It's how many, CMYK, RGB, whatever the file is. Okay. This one is what does CMYK stand for? Uh, cyan, magenta, yellow, and black. That's right, that's right, right. So those are the those, are those those four colors make all the colors, right? Yep. And what I like about printing is there's so many different printing jobs. This is the industry I used to be in right here. That's a from um, there's a die cutting a die cut of a feet right there. Some labels that can be printed. Some purchase order forms. All these different forms in here. Wrap around books. Wrap around books. So if someone wants a nice full color poster, business card. Uh, invitation is it right here it's gonna come out look at that bad boy nice beautiful beautiful posters look at, look at the quality of those posters 
Now, Kevin, what's the cost of something like this? You know, somebody wants 10 of these, what do you charge? That size is $3 a piece. Depending on volume, you can go down from there. How competitive are you with the other guys in town here? No one else does 10 by, or 13 by 19. Oh, this is a 13 by 19. This is not a, 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 a 11 by 17. 11 by 17. So this is a bigger size. So th what's, what's cool about the bigger size? What does that allow you to do? Uh, you can get full bleeds on the sheet. So the full bleed? So you can trim Man. it down. So uh, yeah. you can do two up. Eight and a half by elevens on that, and have full bleeds all the way. And that's around. a beautiful quality job, and the paper's really nice quality paper. This is a numbering machine. No number machine. What, what do you need numbers for? Oh wait a minute. Here's a sample of a number right over here. We number invoices or something like that would be a ticket stub or a drawing stub. And okay. So show us how this machine works. Just load them in. Press start. This is cool. In fact, if you're in the room right now, you can smell the ink in the air. The ink has a very poignant smell. It's a soy base, it's an oil based ink. The blanket that has the image on it. We'll show you that in a minute. So right here is where the ink is. This is black ink. We got black ink in there. Oh, and now here's the ink. Now there's the image. Here I am with Kevin in the back. Uh, there's Kevin back there. And Kevin has his printing press right here. And we just showed you an example of um, offset lithography printing. And uh, here we got Curry printing. Do a little 3D image here. A little 360 I mean, image. Love, I love the selfie cam. It's going to be really fun. You can tell already. Kevin, way wave, wave back there. And there's Kevin, the press operator and owner of Curry Printing here in, in uh, Visalia. So Kevin, let's go show us the cutter, the guillotine cutter next, right? Yep. Ooh, you're gonna like this, the guillotine cutter. Okay, here's the guillotine. Uh, guillotine comes from the French word, I believe. They used to cut lop off the heads of, um, you know, dissidents or later on the, uh, then they do that to like the king, French. We have a postcard here, and it's two up on the, on the cutter, and Kevin is going to go and cut it here. Boom! Look at that thing. Where you're cutting at? Yeah. Once you get two sides on this. Look at that. Okay, here we go. Man. And there you go. They're all cut up, their postcards ready to mail out. Look how beautiful that is. That is pretty stuff there. Look at that. Nice and pretty. Ready to go. Packaged. Somebody's getting a nice little 
little invitation in the mail. Well, I'm here at Kevin's and I'm getting ready to take off, so I want to thank Kevin for having me today to tour his print shop. You got a chance to see a little about printing. I was in printing for, gosh, almost 15 years. I worked for a company called Premier Color Graphics back in the, the 90s and early 2000s. Um, and Kevin's a friend of mine. We've always known each other throughout the last 20 years or so um, from uh, the printing industry. Um, so glad that Kevin showed you his print shop, give you a little edu educational opportunity to see one of the local businesses here in town. And that, you know, even the old school printing is still <clears throat> tied in with some new technology or newer technology with the digital printing. Thanks a lot for enjoying the vlog. See you later. Bye.